Oh, wow. Um, hmm? there's a lack of real anything happening. <laughs> that. <laughs> oh, jeez, Joey. It's supposed to be a pit. Where? D down there. It's a little hard to tell. Uh, I'll, I'll just take your word for it. <laughs> Hey, welcome back to another episode of Potato Mode, the game where we take the most beautiful games we know and turn them into absolute mush. I am Joey, I'm joined by Jean-Luc here. Hello! And we are going to play some Dark Souls Remastered. The game was remastered and re-released uh, just last week, I think? Mm-hmm. And I don't know, I haven't played too much of it, but uh, Jean-Luc, how about you take it away? Tell me how it looks. Uh, it looks pretty good. It's not uh, as big as say something like a Shadow of the Colossus, but they've improved the lighting heavily. They've The fire effects are significantly better than they were. That was also perfect timing, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> this is probably the worst game to try and do like a, a potato mode on. Oh no, I think it's the best game. I mean, it probably is, but like trying to play this. Also, I'm at the top of Sun's Fortress. This is my save right now. This is um, a terrible place to be. So is, is there a good vista here? I think that that's one thing that we always try to look for on the show, is just good <sighs> vistas to appreciate the graphics. If I had gotten to the end of this area, there's actually a really good one. Let me try and see if I can hedge it somewhere else. Okay. I'm going to attempt to go back back down Sense Fortress, which is what you're not supposed to do. <laughs> By the way, beautiful vistas await, Joey. Nice. Um, Where would you like to go? We got uh, a very dark garden. We've got a beautiful... Um, undead uh, village. We have a very, very dark, um, rickety blight town. Hmm. Which of the three dark, dead places would I like to visit? You said the the last one was a blight town. Blight town. Blight town. It's infamous. I think let's go blight town. All right, we're going to blight town. Oh God, blight town. The worst, worst area in the game. Wait, what? what? It's everyone's least favorite. It doesn't seem that bad. It's pretty bad. Uh, in the original version of the game, it ran at a sub 10 frames a second. <laughs> you say 10? 10. 10. 10. God, Joy, I can't believe you made me go all the way back <laughs> here. Uh, For science, okay? For science. All right, anyway, we're here at Blighttown. We've saved. It's uh, it's a disgusting swamp, Joey. Let's make it look worse. So we got the resolution, the refresh rate, display mode, whether you want it full screen or uh, window, mm -hmm. V-Sync, and then here are your four quality options. So right. there's not a whole lot that you can do with it? No. Um, but we can try. All right, so here we go. All uh, right, <laughs> well, everything's stretched. It's somehow bluer looking? So so this kind of brings us back to the, the original version. It, we've kind of demastered the remaster almost. A little bit. The fire's still pretty nice. Uh, I think there's some complaints around this remaster, but for the most part, I would say it, they've done a good job bringing this up to snuff for modern systems, modern PCs. It runs smooth. You don't have to install a third-party mod to get it looking good on PC. Yeah, that's always good. Um, but you probably have some third-party mods of your own. Oh, yeah. I have plenty. Let's go. And so the NVIDIA Profile Inspector, once again, it does a whole lot of weird crap to the, uh, the textures in the game. Uh, which is funny enough, the main thing that they probably changed in Dark Souls Remastered. It's like I haven't, I have not tested it fully at the highest settings, or I mean at the the maximum potato quality. But yeah, there we oh, go. We're getting the good old. I uh, can't see the the text anymore. That's okay. We don't need to see a text. Oh, oh, would you look at that? <laughs> it's a distinct lack of texture. It's a little bit smoother. A little smoother. Hello there. <laughs> Oh, that's the fire effects I remember from the original game. <laughs> I mean, in, in the game's defense, lots of the enemies are just giant, massive blobs of scary crap anyway, right? Yeah. It's actually easier to see stuff a little bit, <laughs> I feel like, in some It's because cases. it's getting rid of, like, the... Is there, like, mist or something? Yeah. Or just, like, all the, the shading yeah, and a little bit the lighting easier. effects. Let's go to a place with a lot of fire. We're going to head to Lost Isolith. Which, funny enough, is actually one of the later areas in the game, and an area that was rushed for time, so it actually already had sort of an unfinished look to it. Oh, God. Again, this area was already kind of looking a little unfinished. It's, it's just a lot of open space. It just kind of gave a, a couple of like little, little arches there, here and there. The texture work doesn't look as bad. Like It's not like missing yeah, textures. I it's think, just very I, muddy. I think because this was probably unfinished, um, it's going to require a little bit more work on our end. Yeah. 
Oh my uh, god. <laughs> I actually love the way this looks. Does it look better? Okay, 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 okay. So okay. this is sort of a unique boss. You're actually supposed to you can you can fight him traditionally or you can um a, turn it into like a kind of scripted sequence mm -hmm. where you can like trick him into like falling off into the lava. Ooh. Or he does that. <laughs> no. I don't remember how to do I don't remember how to do this. <laughs> The lake it is. Honestly, I'm I'm still very impressed that you can <laughs> navigate the menus <laughs> navigate like this menus. so effortlessly. You just kind of get used to it. Oh, yes. Actually, can you park yourself in front of the wall real quick? This is a good old good old potato mode face right here. The thing is, the faces in Dark Souls look so bad, it actually doesn't look that he different. Actually kinda, yeah, I was about to say, he looks not bad. He looks kind of cute, actually. Just kind of with the beady eyes yeah. and just sitting there with his innocent looking face. Oh, wow. Um... Hmm? There's a lack of real anything happening. <laughs> that <laughs> oh, jeez, Joey. Wait, 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 hold on. That's supposed to be a pit. Where? Th down there. That's a pit. <laughs> it's, a little, a it's a little hard to tell. Uh, I'll, I'll just take your word for it. <laughs> oh, what's Framped look like? <laughs> 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 oh, no. What is this? Oh my god! This is one of the little tiny messages that appear on the ground to yeah. let you know. <laughs> Except it's huge! There's normally trees here? The trees are gone, Joey! <laughs> Ho hold on, I need, to, hold on. I need to kill these guys. Skeletons um, did a little bit of groundskeeping, I'm sure. But all these trees are gone! <laughs> yeah, remember? All th there were a bunch of trees here, remember? Beautiful vistas await, Joey. I'm having a hard time remembering, but I'll, I'll take your word for it. I might, I might turn it on just for my own sake to see what <laughs> it looks like. Oh my god! Wait, where's his hair? And his head! What happened to him? Wait, hold on. <laughs> He's got like a long head of hair and a beard? Oh my god! That's what he, that's what he's okay, supposed clear, to look like. Okay, clearly he has hair in here. Oh my god, what? Wow. Wait, does he have clothing? Uh, it's just all flesh colored. It's just all flesh colored clothing. <laughs> Swing it around to the back of his head. <laughs> oh no, the eyeballs! <laughs> you can see the eyeballs, Joey! <laughs> we're, no! we're, we're, we're stopping this right now. No, we have to keep going. <sighs> oh, yep, I'm already seeing a lack of. Tr There's supposed to be trees here. Um, <laughs> you get now they're just <laughs> they're just trunks, little spikes. Oh, you got a little Charlie Brown tree right there. All the leaves are gone. Also, this would, <laughs> this area would lead to the DLC, but I don't think I've unlocked that part also, yet. Also, I'm like really really liking these water ripples. He's like octagonal. Oh yeah, that's great. Oh, this is my favorite part. Is this area? He's like all this <laughs> stuff that should be here that's not, and I love it. Uh, do you want to quickly do a new character? Yeah, or? let's do that. Right, let's do that then. I kind of, I kind of want to go with that hat. I think I look, look pretty cool. Yeah. All right, let's go with the hat. Oh, it's giving me flashbacks of the Wait, Doom episode. <laughs> it's like, it's like yeah. the colors and like, I don't know, the way that the the textures look on like skulls, especially. There's supposed to be like a whole mountain range over here, <laughs> by the way. You can kind of see it, but you can also see the horizon Man, in the background. I, I really, I would love to see a game that actually kind of leans into this art style. Yeah, like I want like, like a potato mode game jam where everyone <laughs> has to make a game that looks like the aesthetic of a potato mode episode. Oh man, that would be good. Victory achieved. Man. Well, I think that was a very successful run for us yes. for potato mode. Uh, if you'd like to see more potato mode, make sure to uh, follow us on YouTube, and we also have it on site as well. Mm -hmm. uh, and if you have a game that you'd like to see potato fight, you can always uh, leave it in the comments below or tweet at us. We'll be sure to add it to our growing list of suggestions. And, oh, by the way, starting this week, we have Potato Mode shirts. Yes. I might as well just promote those as well. I ordered one. It should be arriving in a day or oh, two. Oh, sweet. I haven't gotten one yet, so I will maybe get one <laughs> at some point. You're getting one for free, right? Like, do you have to pay for that? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I bet I'm going to have to talk to someone if, if not. But anyways, we'll just watch this ending cutscene. And we will see you guys next time on Potato Mode. Bye! Um, I wish I was not here. <laughs> this is the worst <laughs> place to start. How is this, how is this bad?
Oh no! <laughs> the camera! <laughs> so demanding.